Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Indian School of Physics. Guys, this is Nitin here and today I have come with a very amazing problem on surface tension. It is surface tension and hypothetical toroidal drop. So this question long back I discussed in uh, my class. So I thought I will be giving this question here also. And uh, here is the problem statement. A droplet of fluid has a donut like shape with the inner radius Ra. Uh, so this radius is given as Ra and outer radius is Rb. Alright, let's consider a cross section of the droplet through its axis. Find the radius of curvature at point B uh, if the radius of curvature at point A is Ra. So this cross section is not perfectly circular but uh, somewhat here you can see in this diagram it is looking like circular but actually uh, you can see at Ra and Rb radius is different. So uh, something like this will be the shape of this a different radius of curvature maybe this will be more appropriate something like this not exactly circular cross section so we have to find out uh, the radius of curvature at b this inner one not the r2 but uh, this uh, inner radius of curvature of this all right perpendicular to the plane of it so here we are going to use laplace equation or you can say uh, for two mutually perpendicular uh, planes, if radius of uh, curvatures are given R1 and R2, then excess pressure uh, can be written as uh, T times 1 by R1 plus 1 by R2. That is for single surface like drop. And if it was a film kind of thing, then uh, 2 would have come here. Anyways, uh, so at point A, now you check here this point A here. So one radius of curvature is this and another radius of curvature is uh, like this. So outside pressure here is P0, here it is P0 and inside it is P and uh, let's assume it is uh, same everywhere. So you can see here one radius of curvature is uh, trying to push it outside and one radius of curvature is uh, uh, on the other side. So P0, let's say P0 is more than P, we are assuming this. So P0 minus P is the excess pressure. So this will be dominating. So I am writing it as 1 by Ra. And this will be in opposite direction. So I have to write it as minus 1 by Ra. Instead of plus uh, 1 by R1 plus 1 by R2, this uh, radius of curvature is negative. Had it been in this direction, same side, then it will be with plus sign. Similarly, at point B, if I write, now point B you can see. So one radius of curvature is this. Another one is this. So RB and capital RB both are in uh, same direction they are pointing so there is no doubt at all that P is greater in this situation and uh, P0 is smaller. So P minus P0 and both are positive I am taking so T times 1 by RB plus 1 by small RB. Now this P0 minus P I can replace here with negative sign so you can uh, just see 1 by small RA minus 1 by capital RA. This T and T gets cancelled and we get the required relation of RB basically from here if we further solve we can get the value of uh, RB. So it is 1 by RB is equal to 1 by RA minus 1 by RA capital RA minus 1 by capital RB. This is going to be the final answer for this uh, problem. So it's an easy concept and uh, if uh, uh, the people will want then they can surely give this kind of problem. It's not very tough but uh, yes yeah, slightly different. So guys, this is uh, Unacademy Light Distance Learning Program. So here you can have a test series and printed notes for IDJ. And there are, uh, <coughs> these tests are curated by top educators for a half year plan and uh, printed books will be delivered at your doorsteps. Video solution to each test will be given and uh, it'll start with uh, this 9999. Uh, nine. You can use my code uh, Nitin sir in order to connect with me on uh, Unacademy. Alright. And these are some batches which will be starting on uh, September 1st. And uh, this is the Emerge batch uh, you can say for 2024 and this 2023 12th pass batch. Alright. And uh, here, uh, this IDJ Mega Combat, and this is like fantastic exam here. Always you'll find new questions. So this is like 60 minutes, 21 questions, and you'll be competing against some of the best uh, students. And uh, yeah, these are the learners who have uh, secured, and they are uh, like regular uh, learners 
who are writing uh, combats and you can win a lot of prizes also so every sunday these combat exams will happen and uh, you can see regular combat takers uh, have scored 99 plus percentile in idj mains 22 there are 324 learners and uh, 18 learners have scored 100 percentile subject wise in uh, those who are writing combat so it's a very good opportunity and these are uh, free tests completely so that's it guys in this video i hope you have learned something new and if that is the case please let me know and uh, see you soon in the next video thank you